A reciprocating compressor compresses refrigerant vapor in a cylinder using a piston. In a way, reciprocating compressors are like automobile engines. The pistons are directly driven through a wrist pin and connecting rod from a crankshaft. Depending on their size, reciprocating compressors may have one or more cylinders. Multiple cylinders may be arranged in line, opposed, or in a V. In each cylinder, reciprocating compressors have both a suction valve and a discharge valve. These valves give the compressor its ability to pump refrigerant vapor against a pressure difference. They are usually located in the head of the cylinder, in passages connected to the high or low pressure side of the system. Let's follow the compression process in a single cylinder reciprocating compressor during one complete revolution of the crankshaft. Starting with the piston at the top of its stroke, or at top dead center, the piston begins to move downward as the crankshaft rotates. Because both valves are closed, the downward moving piston reduces the pressure in the cylinder. As the pressure in the cylinder falls below the low side pressure in the suction line, the pressure difference opens the suction valve, letting refrigerant vapor flow into the cylinder. The piston continues down and pulls in more vapor until the cylinder is filled with low pressure vapor at the bottom of its stroke. Once past bottom dead center, the piston begins its upward stroke. The suction valve closes. As the piston moves up, it reduces the volume of the space in the cylinder, increasing the pressure of the vapor. When the pressure in the cylinder exceeds the high side pressure in the discharge line, the pressure difference pushes the discharge valve open, letting the compressed vapor flow out of the cylinder. This continues until the piston reaches the top of its stroke and most of the compressed vapor has been expelled into the discharge line. When the piston begins its downward stroke, the discharge valve closes. The complete cycle then repeats during each revolution of the crankshaft. This is the mechanical positive displacement vapor compression cycle using a reciprocating compressor. Please take a moment to complete the following learning activity. To continue, make your selection.